All right, so good afternoon. This is Sarah Kent with uh, Crabitat Hermitat 101 um, for our homeschooling project. As you can see, we do have some um, sprouts growing um, over here. Um, now, we did have a loss last night. As you can see, Peggy did pass away last night. We do have her deceased date on there. Um, sadly, when I went in, to put in the new wheel and the bridge to nowhere um, that we created last night. We will be selling those on our Etsy page. Um, we did find Peggy in a very sad state. Now, Peggy was shipped to us by Nature's uh, Gift. Um, dot com. They were the one that I told you about that does the uh, $12 for two crabs with like $7 shipping. So, Mm, takes weeks for you to get your crab from Washington. She didn't arrive in the best condition. Um, this is her brother. Um, his name is Philip, and he is quite healthy. So Nature Gift did send us one healthy crab. Um, now we did bury Peggy last night. Um, you know, rest in peace, Peggy. We um, went ahead and buried her with our other pets. We did notify Nature's Gifts. Um, I have not heard back from them, but it was late last night when we discovered this, and they may not be open on Saturdays. So we'll see if they can rectify this for us. I'm hoping so. They seem to be a pretty reputable company. It looks like in the mail today we have some hermit crab supplies coming from them. Um, originally, they didn't sell us changing shells for poor Philip and Peggy. So um, I do believe that's what's coming in the mail today, but we'll see. Um, we can do an unboxing of that later. If I sound a little wheezy, I'm sorry. The pneumonia still kind of got me. <coughs> they say my lungs are clear, but I don't think they really are. But that's okay. Um, so anyways, as you can see, we've got sprouts growing. we got Philip over here. Up at the top, that is one of our uh, babies that we got from LLLReptile.com. Um, we don't know which one it is. Um, we think it's Houdini. As Houdini likes to escape and climb and be weird in general. And the other babies just kind of like to hide. That's just their personalities. And we're okay with that. Whatever their personalities are is what we support. Uh, we do not try to change that as they're wild animals and wild caught instead of captive bred. As you can see, we've added uh, the Crabbery Shack sticker on there. Etsy, we got some supplies from them. You know, we always give shout outs when we get really cool products from Etsy sellers because we want to support them just like I'm sure hopefully you all support us when we open our business. Um, so there's kind of a view of, you know, the bridge to nowhere and their wheel for exercise, you know, when or if mommy is too sick to get up and get them out to play in their turtle tank, which we got off of Amazon. This was a wonderful product. They do have these on sale right now for Black Friday. Um, they're about $12, um, and it is great when you're cleaning your Herbitat or your Crabitat. Um, you can just put some food in these wells, some water, um, you know, just make it fun for them. I know it's not the best place for them to be, but it's too high for them to climb out. So it makes it pretty, you know, stress-free for them and you while you're trying to clean your cage because you can't watch them and clean your cage. You know what I mean? Especially when you've got seven babies, basically, which is what we've got right now. Um, rest in peace, Peggy. We had eight. Uh, down to seven. But, you know, nature takes its course. And we accept that. So, that's what we got. Anyways, from Amazon, this is really cool. I would suggest this for any Hermitat, um, Crabitat owners. Um, it's a good way to clean their tank stress-free for you and your crabs. Um, so, that was something I got on Amazon. It was pretty great. Um, I'm gonna see if I can get a picture here. It might be a little hard. But under the log, we have a cave that has been dug by one of our bigger jumbos. He's sleeping right now, so we're not gonna try and disturb him. And, of course, we've got, um, you know, our junior, um, our junior gypsum is always up in there. Um, not sure where Sydney is, but we're pretty sure that this is Hermie down there in that little cave he's built. It's probably hard to see. And then, of course, that's Houdini. He's been doing that all morning, and we're okay with that. It is what it is. 
Still using Grandma's light because we still haven't gotten our hood light yet. Um, we do have a table coming for homeschooling, so the Herbitat, no worries, guys. I know a lot of people have expressed concern that this is a very small, um, you know, setup for a 20-gallon long tank. And I measured it yesterday. It's actually 30 long, 30 inches long, so I don't know if that changes things at all. Maybe PetSmart sent me the wrong size. I am not 100% sure, but hey, it works. So, anyways, we've got a homeschooling table that's going to go right here. Um, for Lucian's homeschooling and the hermit hat is going to go on top of that and then he will be able to work um, from his laptop from either the couch or the table where the hermit hat will be um, so that way you know his classmates can see his hermit hat you know while he's working through the Odella school system so you know this is what we got going on today guys just a quick video uh, we'll kind of keep you updated as uh, supplies come in today, what we get, what we're going to do. Um, this is Sarah Kent signing out. Any questions, comments, concerns, like, share, and review. Uh, we are running contests right now for homemade food as well as a extra bath that we had if anybody needs that. Um, we'd be more than happy to give that away on our YouTube channel. So, you know, like, subscribe, comment, share. Um, we'll be contacting people at the end of the month for the contest winners and sending out those prizes. All right. Thanks, guys. Bye.